basketball come in here? I mean, you've done a lot of stuff with USA Basketball. How cool is it to have this team come in here and you guys get an opportunity to go up against them? Yeah, um, I'm super excited for that. Obviously going to be in Gill, um, which is great. Um, but it's going to be an amazing experience for us just to have them in our gym, be able to play against them, compete against them. So I'm really excited. Can you just talk about like the emotions of playing with some of the best, you know, WNBA players to ever play the game in yeah. that regard? Um, it's definitely a little crazy. I don't think it's really <laughs> gonna hit us until we're actually like there. Um, but I know I'm super excited. I know the team's really excited, but it's a little nerve wracking and kind of kind of surreal to be honest. What what is it? It? Will you be stargazing or getting after them? <laughs> <laughs> Probably a little bit of both. Uh, stargazing at the beginning, but I know the team is really competitive, so I know once. Once we get on the floor, it's gonna be it's gonna be competitive. What does it say about the program that they can draw Team USA to Corvallis and you know have an exhibition like this? Yeah, I mean, obviously, Coach Ruick has done a great job with this program year after year. Um, we've made it to Sweet 16, so it says a lot about him, his coaching staff, and just overall this program. For you personally, for this season, what are sort of your goals for the season? Um, personally, I just hope to continue to grow, grow my game individually and just help this team um, be an upperclassman um, this year. I think I'm going to have a bigger leadership role, and then I just hope um, I can help the team continue the success that we've had. A lot of those games later in the year, you were obviously on the floor when, you know, even Destiny was off the floor at times. Do you see your role expanding that much this year? Uh, yeah, a little bit. Um, I think we'll also be able to play. Um, together a lot more. Um, just this whole guard core is very experienced. Um, I mean, we're all upperclassmen pretty much besides obviously Jazz, Noel, but um, they're doing great. And so I'm super excited for this guard core and just the experience that we've had and then that we'll continue to have and continue to grow this year. What did the Italy trip kind of do just to kind of kickstart the season, kind of give you guys some team bonding, all those little things, and are you seeing the fruits of that labor start to pay off in these, you know, heading into the season? Yeah, the Italy um, the Italy trip was amazing. We got to see so much. Uh, it was a great combination of kind of being able to tour around Italy and then also be able to compete. Um, and then we also had practices before Italy, which was a huge jump start for us just to get the team together, actually play against different competition rather than just playing each other every day. But the Italy trip was amazing. Um, I definitely th think the team got a lot closer and we were able to involve the newcomers in a lot quicker than the past years. I was there about three weeks before you. Can you think of anything that stood out you remembered that was really cool? I mean, it was all amazing. The David? Yes, the David was super cool. I uh, personally, I love Rome, being able to walk around Rome and kind of exploring that. That was awesome. And you mentioned the, the, the youngsters. How are the, the freshmen working in and, and getting along? Not just getting along, but coming through with uh, picking up the offense, the defense, all kinds of things. Yeah, they're doing a great job. I'm super proud of them. I remember my freshman year, I was overwhelmed. We throw a lot on on the newcomers and they all done an awesome job just kind of soaking it in they're all like sponges and they take everything that you say and just go and do it so i'm super proud of them and how well they've taken everything and ran with it a lot of added depth to that front court especially with this you know these freshmen coming in a lot of size more this year how are you guys going to be able to utilize that yeah um i mean one thing that coach uh Rooks preaches is we can't be able to be guarded one-on-one -on -one. and i think that's one thing in the post no one can guard them one-on-one. -on -one. Um, they're going to score every time. So I'm super excited for that. Just to have, have those people that can also step out a little bit like Marie and shoot um, kind of extended range. So I'm really, really excited for that. Just kind of see how we're able to use them, use their strengths. And yeah.